Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. My administration here, in the Citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you are here to stay or passing through on Were your you way Are you the only ones on that train? Welcome to City 17. It's safer here. Overwatch stopped our train in the woods and took my husband for questioning. They said he'd be on the next train. I'm not sure when that was. Did they're, they're being nice, though, letting me wait for him. Welcome. Welcome to City 17. You have chosen or been chosen to relocate to one of our finest domains. Don't drink the water. They put something in it to, to make you forget. I don't even remember how I got here. Establish my administration here in the city. Dr. Breen again? I was hoping I'd seen the last of him in City 14. I wouldn't say that too loud. This is his base of operations. And so, whether you are here to stay or. I'm working up the nerve to go on. on your way to parts unknown. Welcome to City 17. It's safer here. I see they took your suitcase too. They can't get away with this much longer. It's on, but they're always they're always departing, but they never arrive. And the ones that do arrive, they, they never leave. You never see them go. They're always full. No one ever gets on, but they're always. Welcome. Welcome to City 17. You have chosen or been chosen to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here. This must be a mistake. I got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. It's me, Gordon. Barney from Black Mesa. Hey, sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Doc, but 
look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here, somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Oh, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon? Good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later. to make this kind of decision for mankind. I don't know about you, but Will I'm ready to try to self protection just to get a decent meal. Let us breed again. You'll have to wait your Allow turn like everybody else. You've got to be damn hungry to wait in line for this crap. And try to answer every possible question you might have left on your list. First, let us consider the fact that for the first time ever, as a species, immortality is in our reach. This simple fact has far-reaching implications. It requires radical rethinking and revision of our genetic appearance. It also requires... If I talk to you out here, we'll both be in trouble. ...in direct opposition to our neural precepts. I find it helpful at times like these to remind myself that our true enemy or the wise instinct. Instinct was our mother when we were an infant species. Instinct coddled us and kept us safe in those hearts scrambled years. I'd like to help you, but it's out of the question. They'll find one. Thank you. 
Oh, I thought you were a cop. Look at him down there. I told you they'd be coming knocking? for us next. Just this once, I hope you're wrong. I can't take it anymore. Everything's gonna be okay. What are you going to do? I'm gonna think of something. When is it all going to end? Don't worry. Attention, residents. Miss Count detected in your block. Cooperation with your civil for the evening. In here! Turn it to the wall. Rather than the roof. There's no time to lose! Get in here, quick! Keep moving! Head for the roof! Dr. Freeman, I presume. We better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. I'm Alex Vance. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure you don't remember me, though. Man, a few words, aren't you? Remember who you like, Mesa? Your role didn't work. <laughs> don't get my dad started on Dr. Breen. Through here. Funny, you showing up on this day in particular. We've been helping people escape the city on foot. It's a dangerous route to my father's lab, through the old canals. Today, we're finally on the verge of having a better way. <laughs> Here, let me buy you a drink. Oh, and by the way, nice to finally meet you. Blast that little... Where did she get to? Lamar! Come out of there! Uh-oh, everything all right, Dr. Kleiner? Oh, uh, hello, Alex. Well, uh, almost all right. Lamar has gotten out of the face. If I didn't know better, I'd suspect Barney of trapping and... My goodness. Gordon Freeman. It really is you, isn't it? I found him wandering around outside. Bit of a troublemaker, isn't he? We owe a great deal to Dr. Freeman, even if trouble does tend to follow in his wake. I must say, Gordon, you come at a very opportune time. Alex has just installed the final piece for our resurrected teleport. I can't take any credit for the breakthrough, Doctor. Nonsense. Your talents surpass your loveliness. <laughs> Let's just see if this thing works, okay? Well, is he here? There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. 
We can't keep him here long, Doc. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry. He's coming with me. Uh, that's right, Barney. This is a red-letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. You mean it's working? For real this time? Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous about. What cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civvies. What? Oh dear, you're right. I almost forgot. Barney, I'll give you the honor. Huh. I've got to get back on my shift, but okay. Here we go. Ah! Damn it, get it off me! Lamar, there you are. I thought you got rid of that pest. Certainly not. Never fear, Gordon. She's de-beaked and completely harmless. The worst she might do is attempt to couple with your head. Fruitlessly. Get that thing away from me. Here, my pet. Up, up. No, not up there. No, no. Careful, Lamar. Those are quite fragile. Oh, fie. It'll be another week before I can coax her out of there. Yeah, longer if we're lucky. <laughs> Barney, you're not an animal person. <sighs> well, Gordon, I see your HEV suit still fits you like a glove. At least, the glove parts do. I've made a few modifications, but I'll just acquaint you with the essentials. Now, let's see. <clears throat> The Mark V hazardous environment suit has been redesigned for comfort and utility. Oh dear. Doc, we don't have time for this. At least get that suit juiced up, Gordon. Good idea. There's a charger on the wall. I've modified your suit to draw power from combine energy outlets, which are plentiful wherever they patrol. Meanwhile, let's get this show on the road. Why don't you position yourself near the panel over there and wait for my word? Isaac, are you there? Yes, yes, Eli. Bit of a hold-up on this end. You'll never guess who found his way into our lab this morning. Uh, that's not who I think it is, is it? Indeed it is, and it's our intention to send him packing straight away in the company of your lovely daughter. Are you ready for us, Dad? You're all set on this end. Then let's do it. Let's see. This field flux should self-limit, and I've clamped the manifold parameters to C1 base and LT orbifold Hilbert intensive. Conditions could hardly be more ideal. That's what you said last time. Hey, uh, yeah, about that cat. Visualizing in three, two, one. No, fiddlesticks. What now? Uh, doctor, the plug. Right ahead. Very good. Final sequence. Commencing now. I can't look. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> well, did it work? See for yourself. Hey, Doc. Oh, thank goodness. My relief is almost palpable. Fantastic work, Izzy. Well, I can't take all the credit. Dr. Freeman proved an able assistant. Let's go ahead and bring Gordon through now. Right you are. Speak to you again in a few moments. Good job, Gordon. Throwing that switch and all. I can see your MIT education really pays for itself. All right, Barney. Your turn. Gee, thanks. Gordon, as soon as you're in position, we'll send you to Eli's. And not a moment too soon. Excellent. Initializing in three, two, one. 
Uh, Barney, if you'd be so kind. Good luck out there, Gordon. Yes, indeed. We're ready to project you, Gordon. Bon voyage, and best of luck in your future endeavors. Final sequence. What the hell? What is it? It's your pet, the freaking headhopper! Rawr! Heavy! Oh. Look out! Certain it was Gordon Freeman. Gordon! The Citadel's on full alert. I've never seen it lit up like that. Get out of City 17 as fast as you can, Gordon. Take the old canals, right? They'll get you to Eli's lab. It's, it's a dangerous route, but there's a whole network of refugees, and they'll help you if they can. I'd come with you, but I gotta look after Dr. Kleiner. Oh, and before I forget, I think you dropped this back in Black Mesa. Good luck out there, buddy. You're gonna need it. you can do here. Unidentified. Turn your with 
Good God. Guess those sirens are for you, huh? Good thing you found us. You're not the first to come through here by This is the free man. The Combine's reckoning has come. Look, we're just a lookout for the Underground Railroad. Main station's right around the corner. They'll get you started on the right foot. Meanwhile, let my Vortigaunt friend here give you a jolt to get you going. <laughs> That is all we can spare. But be careful now. We really can't afford to get noticed. Civil protection catches you down here. It's bad news for the whole railroad. We serve the same history. Attention, please. Unidentified Keep going. That station was raided, but there's others up ahead. I'm gonna stay here in case any others come through. Gotta keep the rail way alive.
Civil protection is on to us. We're tearing up the railroad, covering our tracks. Looks like you're gonna be the last one through. Be glad you're not the guy they're looking for. Poor bastard doesn't stand a chance. Sounds like they're calling in every CP unit in City 17. Now they're flooding the areas up ahead with manhacks. You better get going before they sweep through here. Oh shit! Too late! Close call. Thanks for your help. Look, it isn't safe here. I'll give you some supplies to keep you going, and you really gotta go.
mostly on the civil violation. Implicit citizenship revoked. Status malignant. <laughs>
Major fracture detected. Automatic medical systems engaged. Morphine administered. here at a bad time. Black Mesa East to Station 6. Do you read? Dr. Freeman is on his way down river. Lend him the airboat and give him all the help you can. Repeat, Gordon Freeman has returned. It is critical he reaches Black Mesa East. We've got some ammo in those crates over there. Help yourself to supplies and keep moving. Been hoping you'd show up. Got this airboat all gassed up and ready to go. It's gonna be tough dodging civil protection out there in the open, but drive hard and you'll make it. You'll find more help up at Station 7. Just a few bends up the river. It's the old red barn. Climb on in. Fire her up.
direct confirmation of a disruptor in our midst, one who has acquired an almost messianic reputation in the minds of certain citizens. His figure is synonymous with the darkest urges of instinct, ignorance, and decay. Some of the worst excesses of the Black Mesa incident have been laid directly at his feet, and yet unsophisticated minds continue to imbue him with romantic power, giving him such dangerous poetic labels as the one free man, the opener of the way. Let me remind all citizens of the dangers of magical thinking. We have scarcely begun to climb from the dark pit of our species' evolution. Let us not slide
I wouldn't believe it if I couldn't see it with my own eyes. Dr. Gordon Freeman himself. Just in time, Doc. We gotta move out before the Combine picks us up. We're just getting ready to pull out. We'd better hurry. We gotta tear down this camp and get out of here. Greetings to the Freeman. Come on in. I'll show you what you're up against. Here, take a look at this. This here is the dam. It's just up ahead. Eli's hideout is here, a stone's throw from the apron and nestled in the old hydro plant. But getting there, with that hunter chopper on your ass, next to impossible. Good news is, the Vortigaunt's working his magic on your airboat, so you'll have a little more firepower going forward. I think he's just finishing up now. Go on out. There we are! That gun came off one of the same hunter choppers that you're up against. I always like to bring a little irony to a fire. Take that chopper down. off. The female will accept this weapon or suffer greatly on the road ahead. Farewell, Dr. Freeman.
We remember the free man. We are called Terminus. There is no distance between us. No false veils of time or space may intervene. We see you still in Black Mesa. Clearly we see you in the Nihilans chamber. We bear witness to the bright eternity of the Nihilans demise. You leap, you fall, we see you crush between the barriers. For a brief time you joined us, you are one between the worlds. Communion of the Vortex is a deeper mystery. No deeper than the void itself. We cannot forget those whose cords you cut. Forgiveness is not ours to bestow. Unity of purpose, the shattering of common shackles, a single road we tread. Thank you. 
Hello? Take it easy in there. They're safe now. But you'll have to forgive the scanning process. We can't take any chances. Dr. Freeman? Gordon Freeman? Is that you? You've made it here this quickly while well, Eli is going to be amazed, not to mention relieved. I'm Dr. Mossman, Dr. Judith Mossman. I've been hearing about you since long before the Black Mesa incident. Oh, Black Mesa. I do so envy you working with Eli and Dr. Kleiner when they are at the top of their field. Ah, oh, there we go. You can come through now. I'll take you down to Eli right away. You'd have never forgive me if I kept you waiting. <laughs> we could certainly use the extra help around here. We've covered a lot of ground in the last few months, but things would go so much faster if we had more people with your train. We're closing in on a reliable local teleport technology. Something the Combine still hasn't mastered. Eli thinks their portals are string-based. Similar to our Kalabi Yao model, but they've failed to factor in the dark energy equations. They can tunnel through from their universe, but once they're here, they're dependent on local transportation. If they knew what we were doing with entanglement... Oh. <laughs> Listen to me, I sound like a postdoc. I'm just so excited to think that we'll finally have the chance to work together. Where was I? Oh, yes. Dr. Kleiner compressed the Zen relay far beyond anything he imagined at Black Mesa. We figured out how to use Zen as an unexpressed axis, effectively a dimensional slingshot, so we can swing around the border world and come back in local space without having to pass through. Oh, here's a Eli now. All right, good. You keep right up. Eli, look who I found in the airlock. Gordon Freeman. <laughs> Let me get a look at you, man. My God, you haven't changed one iota. How do you do it? Now, let's see. The last time I saw you, I sent you up for help after the resonance cascade. <laughs> I never thought it would take you this long to get back to me. Welcome to the lab, anyway. It's not Black Mesa, but it served us well enough. It's going to be a lot more like Black Mesa with Gordon here to help. Right you are. MIT graduates are few and far between these days. We'll get you out of that hazard suit and back into your lab coat, where you belong. Let me just finish up some work and I'll see what I can dig up. Dr. Freeman, it's been a real honor. I'm looking forward to working together. Feel free to look around. You remember my wife, Ozian, don't you? That picture and Alex were all I managed to carry out of Black Mesa. We're still not sure what that does. Alex brings in the strangest things. Dr. Breen. He's the administrator of this whole vile business now. He ended the Seven Hours War by managing Earth's surrender. The Combine rewarded him with power. The Eli Vance is indispensable to the liberation. Oh, Gordon. The Vortigaunt said you were here. I can't believe you made it so quickly on foot. I believe he broke your record, honey. Well, he earned it. I guess you proved you can handle yourself out there. There's nothing Gordon can't handle, with the possible exception of you. Dad, please. Uh... Take a look at this, Gordon.
I thought you were on watch. The Vortigons relieved me so I could come see Gordon. Anyway, I should be in here working on the portal. I have the repairs well in hand. Someone misjudged the capacity of the Combine Thyristor. <laughs> Are you blaming me? No, not at all. It was a calculation error, not a mechanical problem. Then maybe you should let me do the calculations next time, as well as installing it. Alex, really? Sometimes I think you deliberately misunderstand me. <clears throat> Alex, why don't you take Gordon along and give him some practice with the gravity gun? Sure. Come on, Gordon. Let's go have some fun. The zero-point energy field manipulator is not a toy, Alex. Ugh, let's get out of here. So I see you've met Dr. Mossman. She's one of the main reasons I spend so much time outside. You should hear her drone on about how it should have been her in the Black Mesa test chamber that day. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't be talking behind her back. It just gets a bit claustrophobic down here. That's the old passage to Ravenholm. We don't go there anymore. Come on. So, here we are. The scrapyard. This is a gravity gun my father was talking about. You can call it the Zero Point Energy Field Manipulator if you really want to. It's designed for handling hazardous materials, but we mainly use it for heavy lifting. Give it a try. The primary trigger emits a charge. You can punch stuff and send it flying. I found it handy for clearing minefields. The secondary trigger lets you grab things. You can throw them with the primary. Once you've picked something up, you can drop it gently by pressing your secondary trigger again. Pick up some stuff and toss it. pull stuff over from a distance. Try grabbing those barrels from that ledge up there. All right. Now let me call Dog. He loves to play fetch. Dog! Come! Good doggy! Gordon, this is Dog. My dad built him to protect me when I was a kid. First model was about yay high. I've been adding to him ever since. Have a night, boy. Okay, dog, let's play catch with Gordon. You'll need to use the gravity gun. Go ahead, dog, throw! Good catch! Throw another, dog! One dog. Dog, go get your ball.
When I told you Dog liked to play fetch, I didn't tell you who'd be fetching, did I? Good throw. Okay, Gordon, let's try something else. Dog, throw something bigger. No dog. No, no boy. Down. Put that down. What is it, dog? Oh my god, what was that? Scanners! Oh, oh the combine sweeping the area. You've got to head back to the lab. Come on, Gordon. Scrapyard airlock stuck in a full auto cycle. Is Gordon still with you? He's right here. Good. I want you to. Dad? Take Gordon out of here. Head for the coast. Do not go through rape. Dad? Dad! Damn it! Dog, open the airlock. Get us out of here. <laughs> Hurry, now! Tear it apart if you have to. Just get it open! That's enough, dog. <laughs> Come on, Gordon! Come on! Gordon, you need to get out of here. I can't leave my father. Dog, take Gordon to the Raven Home Tunnel, then circle around and try to meet up with me. Hurry!
of my traps, but take care not to fall in them yourself. Behind you! In Ravenholm, you do well to be vigilant. Grigori, you have already met my congregation. <laughs> Minor less 
Lacerations detected. Warning. Vital signs critical. Closer. You've stirred up hell, <laughs> man after my own heart. Here I have a more suitable gun for you. You'll need it. Catch! Good. Now, keep it close. My advice to you is, aim for the head. Hush. They come. There is no rest in my horn. Move on and I will meet you at the church.
Send the cart for you, brother. It will be but a moment. Patience, brother. Guard yourself well. Greetings, brother. And so we meet at last. You are to be commended for avoiding my traps. Uh, the work of a man who once had too much time on his hands and now finds time for nothing but the work of salvation. I suspect you have little wish to remain in Ravenholm, so I will show you to the mines. As for me, a shepherd must tend to his flock, especially when they have grown unruly. Follow me, brother, and tread lightly, for this is hallowed ground.
Bond for your reflection, child. Stay close to me, brother. Return to your true nature! Follow me. Quickly, brother. I deliver you to a darker place. May the light of lights illuminate your path. Look to your own salvation. <laughs> <laughs>
Who's hurt? Winston's, Winston's been hit. hit. Patch him up and get him to the back as soon as he's stable. Gordon Freeman. It's incredible you made it. We've been getting communications from Alex. I'll see if I can reach her again. Follow me. It's Leon. We're all clear. And I've got Gordon Freeman. Dr. Freeman, you're kidding. I've been on the line with Alex. Her father's been captured. Over here, Dr. Freeman. Eli Vance is indispensable to the liberation. Alex, it's Leon. And I've got Gordon Freeman with me. Gordon, you made it through Ravenholm. Thank God. I need your help. They've taken my father. He's been taken to Nova Prospect. The Vortigaunts tracked the ship that made off with him and Judith Mossman. While the trains are still running, I'm gonna hitch a ride. Here's where you come in, Gordon. I need you to make your way along the coast until you get to Nova Prospect. It used to be a high-security prison, and it's something much worse than that now. But I think it's still easier to sneak in than to break out. You wanted to take the coast road? He won't last five minutes on foot. It's spawning season for the ant lions. That's why I called you, Leon. I was hoping you still had the scout car we left with you last summer. The one my dad rigged with the Tau cannon. Yeah, good idea. Hold on a sec. Narco? Bring the buggy out. Put it on the dock right now. Gordon Freeman will be driving it. Will do. I just finished mounting an ammo crate on the back. Good timing. Okay, Alex, we're all set. <sighs> Thanks, Leon. Gordon, I haven't driven the coast in over a year, but I have no reason to think it's gotten any safer. Meet me in the depot where the trains unload. Take care of yourself, and I'll see you in Nova Prospect. Bye for now. Bye, Alex. Okay, Doc. Before you hit the road, you might want to grab some med kits, uh, restock on ammo, maybe check the map, see where you're headed. There's an ammo supply crate on the back of the car, if that's any comfort. Stay with the car, make use of the thumpers. You'll stand a fair chance against the ant lions. I'll radio ahead to let the next base know you're coming. That map is out of date, but you can still see more or less the route to Nova Prospect. Can't vouch for the road, though. We've lost touch with some of the outposts. Shore point to NLO. Shore point to New. Shore point to NLO. Shore point to New Little Odessa. Come in, Odessa. You read. Hello, Dr. Freeman. The car's all ready for you. Hop in and I'll lower you down to the beach. Good, here we go.
Hurry, get in the basement. We're expecting gunships at any moment. Colonel Coverage will be glad to see you made it. This steerable rocket launcher is our best bet for taking down a gunship. Ah, hello. I'll be right with you. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. Using the laser guide, you can steer your rocket past the gunship's defenses and prevent it from shooting down your rocket. This will only anger it at first, but if you can survive long enough to make several direct hits, you'll be rewarded with a prize worthy of any mantelpiece. Now... Who's going to be the lucky one to carry it into combat? Ah, oh, yes. Gordon Freeman. I couldn't have asked for a finer volunteer. Colonel Odessa Cubbage, at your service. Damn. Let me just send a warning to Lighthouse Point, and then I'll come right up and lend a hand. Go on. Teach that gunship a lesson it will never forget. Remember, use the launcher's laser gun. Steer your rocket past the gunship's defense.
radio chatter. They're looking for your car. Okay, Doc. You'll have to go on foot from here. There's a secret path along the cliffside, but no one's going anywhere until we fight off this attack. Having you here to fight alongside us is going to make a big difference for morale. Oh, crap. Here come the dropships!
This way, Dr. Freeman. We'll take the cliff path before another gunship finds us. Right along there, and watch your step. Sorry, Freeman. Stay on the rocks! Don't step on the sand, it makes the antlions crazy! Laszlo, don't move! No. Help! <laughs> Dear God! Poor Laszlo! The finest mind of his generation! To come to such an end! We were heading for the Vortigaunt camp, hoping to pick up some bug baits of these damn things and leave us alone. But without Laszlo... What's the point? I know you tried to help. I'll stay with him a while. There's something I have to do. Go ahead. And I hope you have better luck than we had.
man must follow. The Fremen will do wise to heed our directions of the Myrmidon's aromatic pheromones. The process is not entirely hygienic, therefore stand aside. Three men will have need of these fur parts on the paths ahead. Gather them now. Pods myself. <laughs> the free man must excuse us. It is rude of us to commune by flux shifting in front of those whose vocal inputs are in band. Yes, we will vocalize in your auditory language as a matter of courtesy. Unless we wish to say unflattering things about you. Just so. is just ahead. One man alone wouldn't stand much chance going in there. But a man with a pack of antlions, well, that's a different story. Freeman honors us by his presence. Follow Freeman. Shepherd and lions with the so called bug bait. The free man will now break out his venom pod and toss one into yonder pit. The free man has done well. The free man can also coax his lions to attack specific targets. Observe the training mannequin and mark it well with another pheromone. The Freeman again excels at all tasks. Now, attend well. Apply pressure to your pheromone to signal the outlines in your command to follow you. The free man shows his excellence in all things. And now this one must bid the free man farewell. Nova Prospect lies just beyond. Remember well what you have learned here. The Eli Vance has greatest confidence in you.
priority warning. Outland stabilization force six noble suspect. Perimeter restrictors disengaged. Priority warning. Perimeter restrictors disengaged. <laughs> Priority warning. Perimeter restrictors disengaged. All stabilization delegates move to a code and
Gordon, you made it. Boy, am I glad to see you. I'm glad you made it here in one piece. My dad's up there somewhere, in that holding area. It's gonna take some doing to get him out. Let's get out of here. flying blind here. Every now and then a Vortigon gets captured and sends back information, but we don't have a complete picture of the place. The little we do know is all bad. Get ready. security system. Now to find my father. Oh my god. These poor people. There. All right, I think I can bring him in. There. He's on the way. Let's go meet him. Follow me. Right? I'm fine, would you? You've got to get out of here. We're here to get you out, Dad. Never mind me. Save yourselves. No, we're not leaving you. I think I can recalibrate the Combine portal to get us out of here. But where will you go? I talked to Dr. Kleiner. His portal was almost working again. If he's managed to repair it, we'll end up there. If he hasn't, well... We couldn't be any worse off. It's not worth the risk, Alex. I can't lose you. Get out while you can. We're not leaving here without you. That's final. We can't leave Judith here either. Don't worry, Dad. We'll find her. For now, I'm going to send you to the teleport chamber. I'm not saying goodbye, Dad. We'll meet you there. I know you will. I'll see you there, baby. Let's get out of here. All right. Over here. I'm gonna head back to the security station and try to patch into your suit radio. Wait till you hear from me. Hey, take care of yourself. Let's see what I 
can do to clear the way for you. Keep an eye out for Mossman. I'll get my dad through the prison as far as I can, then I'll catch up with you. Hang on, I'll see if I can figure out how to get that gate open. Okay, got it. Systems engaged. Morphine administered. I'll start working on this gate. Just a sec. Okay, got it. Uh oh, look at the monitor.
Sorry it took me so long. Glad to see you're okay. Let's see if we can find Mossman. It looks like this station might give me better access. There she is! Wait a minute. How'd she... It's from your area. I I'm not calling about that. What's she up to? You promised you weren't going to touch Eli. Oh my the God. soldiers were a bit overzealous, I admit, but he was too tempting a prize to simply turn loose. Especially in the absence of Gordon Freeman. You would have had Freeman if you'd been patient and just waited for my signal. We weren't entirely sure you were ever going to get around to that. Human loyalties being what they are. Dr. Br... As I have stated before, you have to let Eli come around on his own. I have just... known Dr. Vance far longer than you, my dear. I'm afraid your feelings for him may have blinded you. Feelings? This has nothing to do with feelings. It's a simple truth that when Eli believes This our... is not open to debate, Dr. Mossman. Doctor, please. So sorry, Judith. I'm all out of time. Damn her! I don't believe this! Come on, Gordon. Now we've really got to hurry. Go on ahead. I'll disrupt the next level of security and catch up with you when I can.
Sterilizer and containment seals. <laughs> Airwalking, augmentation support. Six, eight, drop and converge immediately. <laughs> soldiers in all directions.
sorry to take so long, Gordon. Looks like you could have used some help. I won't leave you again, though. Now let's track down Mossman. Another security station. All right, Mossman, where are you? Ha. Huh. Founder. Ha! Got you now. Uh oh. Well, come on, Gordon. We don't want to keep her waiting. Leave it talking to me, Gordon. We may need her to get out of here. Hello? Oh, thank God, someone. Alex? Gordon, how did, you, how did you get in here? We know all about you and Brain. What? You've been a spy for the Combine the whole time. W what are you talking about? Damn it! Move back, Mossman. We're coming in. Alex, whatever you may think, I assure you, I have worked to protect your father. Shut up and be glad you're still some use to us. We're going to reconfigure this teleport and get the hell out of here. You see, we're working to the same end. I've already reprogrammed the modulator to emulate a Zen relay. That's my father's work you stole. It's my work too. And I had to prove to Dr. Breen that your father would be the most valuable member of any research effort going Enough forward. Enough of your here. bullshit! Look, Gordon, there's my dad. I'm going to bring him in. You found Eli? No thanks to you. Just enter the coordinates for Dr. Kleiner's lab and let's get moving. But we need access to the teleport platform and we're locked out. I'll take care of that. Let's get going. Oh my god. Have you been working with this thing? For how long? Until now. I did have a fairly good idea of what to expect. I'll bet you did. It looks like it's waiting for us. The Combine uses a peculiar pulse-forming network with a very long rise time. It takes quite a while to recharge. So you... 
Warmed it up for us. Good. And just in time. Dad, down here. Sorry we took so long. I hope that wasn't too bad for you. Don't worry about me, sweetheart. Judith! I see they set you free. Not exactly. Eli! I was so worried about you. The coordinates, Dr. Mossman. So, this is the Combine portal. It's smaller than I imagined. Hurry up, Mossman! Dr. Kleiner! Yes, Alex. Where are you? We're in Nova Prospect, and we're running the Zen emulation for the first time. Are you ready for us? Ready, willing, and fully enabled. Good. We'll send my dad through first. He's in position for... What's that? Hold on, gotta bring this back down. No! Stop! What are you doing? I'm sorry, Alex. It's the only way. No! Get back! What's going on, Dad? Alex? Jonas! No! What's happening? Reset the portal. Gordon, use the turrets.
where's Dr. Kleiner? Dr. Kleiner, let us out! Alex? Gordon? My God, how did you get here? And when? What's wrong? My dear, I... I had given up hope of ever seeing you again. I was afraid we might not make it either. I think the teleport exploded just as we were porting out. Indeed, it did. And the repercussions were felt far and wide, but that was over a week ago. What do you mean? Gordon and I were just there a minute ago. Fascinating. We seem to have developed a very slow teleport. This suggests an entirely new line of investigation. A week? Then what have we missed? A great deal, my dear. The blow you struck at Nova Prospect was taken as a signal to begin the uprising. But what about my father? Well, that is most troubling. According to the Vortigaunts, he is a prisoner at the Citadel. We've got to get my father out. Barney has been leading a push with that very aim in mind. And another of your friends arrived several days ago. Dog, you made it! Good boy! <laughs> so there, you see? It's not all hopeless. I wish I shared your optimism, Doctor. Doc, come in, are you there? Hey, Doc, are you there? Yes, Barney, and I'm no longer alone. Alex and Gordon have just arrived. Well, man, that's good news. I almost gave you guys up for lost. We're planning to set up a staging area for attacking the Citadel. Gordon and Doc can head your way. I want to get Dr. Kleiner somewhere safer. Then I'll meet up with you. I'll take all the help I can get. Aw, oh, crap! Incoming! Go on! Get going! Okay, Gordon, you heard him. I'll catch up with you as soon as I get Dr. Kleiner settled. Just a minute. I can't leave without Lamar. Oh, no. Now, where did she get to? Go on, Gordon. I'll take care of this. Gordon, take care of yourself out there. Dr. Kleiner, there's really no time. She's around here someday. We'll find you another pet head crab. There are plenty to go around. There's only one hitty.
time, too. With you. With you here, Dr. Freeman, we can finally make some headway. Over here! Oops. Hey, everybody! Let's go! Hey, down, hey, down there. there! Supplies! Supplies. Look, Look out below! below. They're everywhere! Don't waste the hoppers, Dr. Freeman. We can use them against the Combine. If you can get those hoppers up without setting them off, you can plant them wherever you want. Dr. Freeman, I'll come with you.
Over here! Enterprise refusal to collaborate is simply a refusal to grow. This is called suicide. Did the lungfish refuse to breathe air? It did not. It crept forth boldly while its brethren remained in the blackest ocean abyss, with lidless eyes forever staring at the dark, ignorant and doomed despite their eternal vigilance. Would we model ourselves Sorry. on a trilobite? Are all the accomplishments of humanity... Busy? Hey, it's Freeman! You're not leaving without me!
Freeman? Stay and hold on this spot. Dr. Freeman, the Combine has cut our supply tunnel in two. If you'll join up with us, we'll take a stab at pushing through their outpost.
Get moving! That door's locked from the other side, Dr. Freeman. Maybe you can find a way around. Looks nasty in there. Good thing you've got that suit. Good call, Doc. Help! Hey, everybody, follow Freeman! Stay and hold down this spot.
Okay, come across. Okay, come across. Sorry, Doc. Let's go! We were looking to join you, Dr. Freeman. Wait for me! while I reload.
Sure thing, Gordon. You got it, Doc. goes. find you here. I've got Dr. Kleiner in a safe spot. Now we can join up with Barney. There's a command center downstairs. I'm hoping to find information about generator locations. Ready? Let's go. Sorry. Well, we're in luck. There's a generator in the square outside. We're trying to disable as many as we can to loosen the Combine's grip on this sector. It'll take me a few minutes to expose the core, then I'll need you to hit it with a burst from the gravity gun. In the meantime, watch my back. We were looking to join you, Dr. Freeman. Test. Yeah. Let's go. Excuse me.
internal shield. Here, have a med kit. Barney should be on the far side of that canal. Well, there used to be a bridge here. Let me see if I can scout a new path. Ah, wait for me here.
deleted.
Dr. Freeman! Barney said you were on the way. We got split up by snipers, and he's pinned down in a warehouse up ahead. Go ahead, he's relying on you. Wait for me! old friend, aren't you? Maybe you can help him. Snipers trapped him up on that warehouse roof. He was going for a cache of grenades, but I doubt he can get to them now. Go on, Dr. Freeman. was infested. The rest of them headed upstairs. They, they took their chance with the snipers. I guess they're still up there. I can't move. These snipers got me pinned down. Gordon, lob a couple grenades. That'll clear them out. Gordon, take out these snipers, would you? Gordon, lob a couple grenades, that'll clear them out. All right, thanks, Gordon. Now let's clear out of here.
Let me get this gate. My civil protection status still gives me limited clearance. Did you hear a cat just now? That damn thing haunts me. Watch the head, Humpers, Gordon! museum or something like that. Whatever the hell it used to be, now it's a nexus for Overwatch in City 17. It's the main source of pain for this part of town. There it is, the Overwatch nexus. Looks like they're mobilizing big time. You can sort of see the gate from here. I'll show you when we get to street level. We'll have to get in that building to open the gate. Even then, the suppression device will Suppress anyone coming through unless we shut it down. Then let's go! So much for stealth. We've been spotted! the security console. Great, I'll open this up. Uh-oh, drop ships. They'll be coming from the roof. If we want to get through these shields, we'll have to take out the generator one at a time. Here, have a med
which owns the roof, and that's where we're headed. Set some traps for them, Gordon.
Get it open. Done. I'm gonna stay here and keep these Dr. gates open wait. long enough we'll to make come a with difference. You. Go on up and connect the sky bridge. We need to let reinforcements come through from every possible direction. If any more citizens come through, I'll send them up to find you. See you when I see you, Gordon.
since you shut off the suppressor and opened the gate, we can really move people through now. The Combine's gonna feel the squeeze. We dropped a crate of rockets coming across the plaza. If you can make it there, you should have everything you need to take down these striders.
It's a mess out there. This close to the Citadel, they've turned the streets over to Striders. I think we can push them back if we can just get to high ground. We're almost to the Citadel wall, Doc. I don't know how the hell we're gonna breach it, but you've made it this far. I'm sure you'll think of something. We have to get to the horse! with you.
came crashing through the plaza, knocking over walls, and I think he's looking for Alex. He seems to have it set in his head that she's in the Citadel. I figured Alex wouldn't want him getting any deeper in trouble, but hell, you try stopping him. Hey, dog! Not there! You can't get through that way! I'll be damned. I think he wants you to go through, Gordon. You'd better hurry. And if you see Dr. Breen, tell him I said...
So, this is Dr. Freeman. At last. I wish I could say this was a pleasant surprise, but it's neither a surprise nor, as you will surely agree, very pleasant. Well, I am nothing if not pragmatic. circumstances, I like to think we might have been able to work together in an atmosphere of mutual trust and respect. Certainly judging from your brief tenure at Black Mesa while I was its administrator, you showed every promise of becoming a valuable and productive contributor to the scientific process. And yet, I'm not sure what spurred you to it. But there is really no place in this enterprise for a rogue physicist. My disappointment in Eli Vance and Isaac Kleiner is far greater than my sorrow over your unfortunate choice of career path. In a way, I suppose you could not have done otherwise. Who knows what seeds of iconoclasm they planted when you were young and gullible, but while they certainly share a great part of the responsibility for the recent troubles, it is you alone who have chosen to act with such willful disregard for humanity's future.
I'll take him from here. Don't struggle, it's no use. Until you're where he wants you, there's nothing you can do. I'm sorry, Gordon. Inhabited by vast meteorological intelligences. Worlds stretched thin across the membranes where the dimensions intersect. Impossible to describe with our limited vocabulary. What I've seen is also beyond words, Breen. Genocide. Indescribable evil. Good God. Well, if it isn't Gordon Freeman at last. What's this? I'll put it over there. You have my gratitude, Doctor. First you lead me straight to the doorstep of my oldest friend, and then you deliver yourself. If I'd known you were going to come straight up to my office, I wouldn't have bothered hunting you in the first place. Having both of you in my keeping ensures I can dictate the terms of any bargain I care to make with a Combine. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Bree. Huh. Wallace. Yes, Judith, what is it? The bargain we should be making is for Eli's life so he can continue his research. Thanks to you, we have everything we need in that regard. You're more than qualified to finish his research yourself. What neither you nor I can't do is convince that rabble in the streets to give up their senseless struggle. Yet Eli refuses to speak the words that would save them all. Save them? For what? Eli, if you won't do the right thing for the good of all people, maybe you'll do it for one of them. Alex, I need... Dad. Gordon? No. God damn you, Bring you let her go. That's all up to you, my old friend. Will you let your stubborn short-sightedness doom the entire species, or will you give your child the chance her mother never had? How dare you even mention her? Alex, my dear, you have your mother's eyes, but your father's stubborn nature. You haven't seen a bit of it yet. Really? Well, let's see how well it serves you on the far side of a combined portal. Go ahead, Bree. <laughs> if that's the worst you can do, send us both through your portal. Oh, it's hardly the worst. But you might find that hard to believe once you get there. It isn't necessary. I agree. It's a total waste. Fortunately, the Resistance has shown it is willing to accept a new leader. And this one has proven to be a fine pawn for those who control him. No! Don't listen to him, Gordon! How about it, Dr. Freeman? Did you realize your contract was open to the highest bidder? Gordon would never make any kind of deal with you. I understand if you don't wish to discuss this in front of your friends. I'll send them on their way, and then we can talk openly. Don't struggle, honey. Dad, I'm so sorry. Alex, Sula. Judith, what do you think you're doing? We're doing what I could never do alone. We're stopping you. Yes. Guards, get in here. They know you betrayed them. They'll turn on you. Judith, Dr. Mossman, please. I'm sorry, Wallace. You're all out of time. Don't. Hurry! Dad, hang on. You fool! Watch out, he's gonna- No! Don't worry about me, honey. There's no time, Alex. He's on his way to the portal. You'll need this. Dr. Mossman, Judith, look after my father. Don't you worry. Dad, I'm not saying goodbye. Never. Come on, Gordon. Let's go. That's my girl. I'm not leaving you again, Eli. Come on! Gordon, we haven't known each other very long, but... I know you didn't have to do this. 
I had to rescue my father, but you... Well, thanks for coming after me. It's me you should be concerned. Hey, listen. I can still deliver... That's him. ...but not without your help. The portal destination is untenable. Surely you can set the relay elsewhere. There's no way I can survive in that environment. A host body? You must be joking. I can't possibly... Yeah, he is. Oh, all right. Damn it. That's what it takes. Just hurry. He's right behind me. Oh, shit. Damn it! Not again! Hey! Look what he left behind. The gravity gun. <laughs> he doesn't have a clue, does he? I wonder where he's going. their tunneling entanglement device. We'll never have a chance like this again. We've got to stop Dr. Breen. I can't shut it down. Looks like he's turned over control to the other side. You'll have to go into the core and do what you can. Get in the elevator and I'll let you in. Don't forget to charge up your suit. Do your worst, Gordon. But be careful.
Dr. Freeman? Is it really that time again? It seems as if you only just arrived. You've done a great deal in a small time span. You've done so well, in fact, that I've received some interesting offers for your services. Ordinarily, I wouldn't contemplate them, but these are extraordinary times. Hmm? <clears throat> Rather than offer you the illusion of free choice, I will take the liberty of choosing for you. If and when your time comes round again. I do apologize for what must seem to you an arbitrary imposition, Dr. Freeman. I trust it will all make sense to you in the course of... Well, I'm really not at liberty to say. In the meantime, this is where I get off. Where did she get to? <laughs> <laughs>